All right, y'all, this is Willie Bill. I got today for you, I got a toilet tissue eat a travel pack. This stuff, this is something that's near and dear to my heart. I, to, to put it politely, I, I frequently visit the latrine. Uh, my body appears to process things in a rapid manner and, uh, and uh, something to help increase the level of comfort when you have to uh, evacuate your system frequently is, is something that scores very high in my book. Uh, this here is toilet tissue is exactly one of those things. It's in a small little package and uh, I think when I bought this I got it on the, on the internet and uh, I got like, like six of these or something in a bag. It's made by a company called uh, Cotton Buds Toilet Tissue Paper Hygienique to go up. Oh, this is like French. This is like French toilet paper. Where are they making this stuff? Made in the USA. This is very interesting. So there is a French translation on here. Toilet tissue translated to Papier Hygienique. And then it says to go. And then it says, I import hair. So apparently, a Willie Bill, I import hairs quite a bit because I, I, like, I like to go. Uh, uh, even on the bottom here, it says it's two ply. There's 300 inches by 4.5 inches. So it's 300 inches long by 4.5 inches wide. So if you need to measure something that's 4.5 inches, you can actually use this toilet tissue to measure it. And then there's 75 sheets. Then there's a slash mark, and it says two impasseurs, 300 PO by 4,5 PO, 75 fouilles. I don't speak, I don't talk French very good, uh, but I try. So they must export this. You know, people these days are saying, United States, we don't. We don't make anything here anymore. We don't have any exports. We got nothing that we provide to the rest of the world. Well, it says right on here it's made in the USA. We got French translations on here, so clearly we're sent it to France land. So I don't understand why we we'll say we ain't exporting anything anymore. We're sending toilet tissue to, to French people. That's pretty good. I mean, that's something you need. That's an industry that ain't going anywhere. We haven't figured out how to not go to the toilet. So, get back into it. I'm sorry, I get, I go off on little tangents here, here and there. I apologize for that. It says here is biodegradable. Now, if you're not familiar with the term biodegradable, uh, what that means is that you can, you can put this in the ground and it will become one with Mother Earth. And that, don't, don't picture that too much because like think about your dirty toilet tissue becoming one with a with a feminine being is a strange way to look at it but uh if, if you appreciate this planet which which I certainly do I, I enjoy spending my time outside that's why we have an outdoor show or review products for getting out there uh, you want to take care of the planet right? It's getting hot or it's getting colder. Human did this, human did that, whatever. How about just take care of the place you live? Maybe that's just a nice sentiment that we could all agree on, right? So, one of the things you can do to make an effort in that direction is use a product that's biodegradable. This is not something that you are likely going to pack out with you. Some park, some place you have to. But for now, at least here in Colorado, most of the places you go, if you have to go to the restroom, you dig yourself a hole, you use it, and you cover it back up. And don't do that near a damn trail, people. You, this is a problem. I, I see toilet tissue like a couple feet off the trail or like a little pile of human feces. You quit it. Quit, quit it, all right? The idea is you're supposed to go off to where traffic is not necessarily passing get yourself behind a bush or something dig a good size hole relieve yourself clean yourself 
and then cover that hole up. If you're using a biodegradable toilet tissue, it will all kind of become fertilized, right? It rusts away, it goes away. It's not something, not like you're wiping your ass with a plastic bag that suffocated two seals. So then you got all sorts of dead stuff and then you're poisoning the plants. There's a biodegradable toilet tissue. Do it right, keep yourself clean, keep it nice for other people, all right? So yeah, biodegradable toilet tissue. Keep yourself comfortable in the woods. This thing, um, as opposed to having, and I apologize, I get off on these tangents. Back to the review, here's Willie Bill. Review mode. <laughs> This particular toilet tissue, one of the huge advantages of this over your home toilet tissue is that it's about the size of the cardboard part that'd be on the inside. But there's no inside, it's solid. So it takes up less room. I don't know about you, but I've tried to backpack with a whole roll of toilet tissue in my backpack. And that toilet tissue Though it's paper, hopefully it's biodegradable, but there's a chance it's got some junk in it and it ain't supposed to be in nature. I wasn't doing the right thing when I was doing that, and it was horribly impractical. This one fits in your bag real nice, it's biodegradable, and it's going to be way better for you, for your comfort, pulling leaves off of trees and stuff. You, you take a maple leaf off a maple tree and wipe your posterior with it. Well, now you just use the tree's toilet paper. What well, well, if it needs to go? It makes its own. That is a self-sufficient organism. And now you just stole its toilet tissue from it and use it yourself. How you gonna feel about that? Bring you some cotton buds toilet tissue. And be, be good, be courteous out there, man. Enjoy what we have. I, I, I believe that what we have is limited, so enjoy it while we have it, all right? That's it for me. Uh, I definitely recommend this product. Get yourself some toilet tissue. Get outside and uh, be safe. Take care of yourself now.